how to install MIUI 12 Xiaomi EU on the Redmi K20 Pro or the Xiaomi Mi 90 Pro. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can install Xiaomi EU MIUI 12 ROM on your Redmi K20 Pro or the Xiaomi Mi 90 Pro. As you can see, I do have the Redmi K20 Pro running MIUI 11.0.4.0 stable based on Android 10. What are the prerequisites for this video? Well, you need to have an unlocked bootloader and you need to have two up recovery installed. How do you do that? I have separate videos for both of those, which can be found in the description of the video. Next thing, make sure your battery is charged at least 50 to 60 percent. Do not do this process if your battery is at 20 or 30 percent. Also, make sure you have a backup of all the pictures, videos, and anything important which you have on your device. Because if you run into any encryption issues or any boot loops, then you will have to do a format data from to up recovery, in which case you are going to lose all your pictures, videos, and anything important which you have on your device. All the files which we are going to use in this video are linked in the description of the video. First thing we need to do is we'll go into settings and then we will go into password and security and you need to remove your password, fingerprint unlock and face unlock. Once that is done, you will go back, scroll down, go into me account and remove your me account. Once that is done, go back, go into accounts and sync and remove your Google account. Once you have removed all the accounts and security measures, you do need to reboot your device once. Why are we removing all the accounts and security measures? Well, we are doing this because we are switching over from one ROM to another and I don't want you peeps to be locked out of your own device. Another question which I get a lot is what if I am on a custom ROM? Well, in that case, you're going to skip the steps which are not applicable to you. And in this case, the best example would be removing your me account. Next thing you need to know is whether your device is encrypted or not encrypted. So for that, you'll go back into settings and then password and security and privacy. As you can see, encryption and credentials, for me, it says phone is not encrypted. This means that once I flash Xiaomi EU ROM, I will have to flash disable force encryption file. And as I mentioned earlier, links to all the files can be found in the description of the video. Next thing we need to do is boot into Coop Recovery. So for that, the first thing we're going to do is turn off our device. And once the device has turned off, we need to press and hold volume up and power button at the same time till we see the two up recovery boot logo once we have booted into two up recovery first thing we're going to do is going to wipe advanced wipe and select all with cache system vendor and data do note wiping of data will result in wiping out of your applications and app data and once you have selected all the appropriate partitions swipe to wipe once that is done we'll click on the home button go into install and now you need to navigate to the folder where you have downloaded Xiaomi EU ROM zip file. In case you downloaded the file on your phone directly, it will be in the download folder. In my case, I have transferred it manually, so it is in the root directory. And here is the file which we are looking for, Xiaomi EU. Just select the file and then swipe to confirm flash. Once the file has flashed successfully, we will click on the home button. And now, those of you whose device was not encrypted, we need to flash disable force encryption. So first thing we need to do is we'll go into mount. Make sure that the vendor partition is mounted. In case it is not, just click on the box beside it. Make sure it is mounted. You get the check mark. Then click on the home button. Go into install. And the next file which we need to flash is disable force encryption. Select the file and then swipe to confirm flash. An important thing to note while Flashing disable force encryption is that make sure it is patching some F stab. So here it is, you can see that it says patching F stabs vendor slash etc slash F stab dot qcom, which means our F stab was patched successfully. Next thing, all you need to do is going to reboot and select system. However, if you run into any boot loops or any encryption issues, you will have to boot back into two up recovery by pressing and holding volume up plus power button at the same time till you see the two up recovery boot logo then you'll go into wipe format data type in yes and then click on the check mark button on the bottom right of the keyboard for now 
you're going to skip the format data part go into reboot and then select system and there it is we do have the new miui 12 boot animation on our redmi k20 pro which means we are booting into miui 12 xiaomi eu rom now in case you want this boot animation on your xiaomi device i do have a separate video on how to do that and again that video can be found in the description of this video and it is also in the pinned comment of this video now the first boot up is going to take some time so you have to be patient and there it is we are on the setup screen let me skip the initial setup real quick but in the meantime here are all the languages which are supported by xiaomi eu so in case you want to have a look at whether your language is supported or not feel free to pause and see what all languages are supported by xiaomi eu and there it is we can also go into settings and my device bam here it is xiaomi eu 20.4.30 beta and of course this is based on android 10 if we go into all the specs you will see that the android version is android 10. we can also go into settings and password and security and look for privacy bam here it is phone is still not encrypted which means disable force encryption was flashed successfully as for the apps which come baked in here on screen are all the applications which do come baked in with xiaomi eu you do have a screen recorder and fm radio in the building along with me mover and here is the camera application as well let me click on allow only while using the application and you do have the camera with the new ui and before i forget let us turn off the device and see whether twerp recovery was overwritten or not i am pretty sure we will still have twerp recovery installed on our device so press and hold volume up and power button at the same time till we see a recovery bam here it is team win twerp recovery in the building which means you do not have to flash magic square twerp recovery to stick of course it does take some time for the touch drivers to load so there it is peeps that is how you install miui 12 xiaomi eu on your redmi k20 pro or the xiaomi mi 90 pro and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you